Ostwald's done now. Now you might be saying, why did you do Ostwald? It's not really that much of a thing. Well, it adds this national focus. Land fort construction speed increase. So we get rid of Rudolf Hess. And we bring in Fritz Todd. Or Tot. And we dismantle the Czechoslovakian forts. Which means that if we want to build a land fort, we should be able to do it basically stupidly fast. So we've got like three 20% boosts, not including construction boosts already that we've researched. Hard Survival 4 Chad Invasion Part 3. We'll get it right this time. <laughs> I know me. I didn't. Glider planes equipped. Got mit uns, French fuckboys. Every unit just entrench. Dig in. Do not move. Stop. Everyone stop. Right then, you have been... Let's find... All these units have now completed their drops. They're now all assigned to this front line. And bunkers are being constructed in every sector of the front. Doesn't matter what level will make them. Cancel the air bridges, they're done. Not everybody just the power drop orders. Oh, we actually got more reinforcements we can send in. They don't really need training. They're going to die very quickly anyway. We need all the casts we can to cast the hell out of them. Good. More men just power dropped into the zone. That's 18... Divisions, they're all at like a third strength at best. That's okay, any more divisions that get made, maybe this one might be done soon. We'll send them in afterwards. So, now it's time to establish an air bridge. This should send in around seven supply, which is what we need. For some reason they're not attacking, which is allowing me to get these bunkers in position. And the Maginal Line units are starting to increase in attrition. These units are li at like a third strength. Oh cool, and they're attacking across the river apparently as well, which is making li my life a lot more easier. Okay, level 2 bunkers in all of these sectors. Making our life easier and theirs harder. Come on! You can do it, boys, and I'm uh, hoping the Luftwaffe's doing the job. I've got like 1,000 Stukas in the air and another 1,000 Heinkel 111s. Huh, they're getting a bit of air damage in too. And I'm being affected by attrition as well. Lacking range to... Right, move the air bridge as far forward as possible.
Lacking range to completely cover area. Don't need the entire area. We've got... you just got to fly like a few meters over the French border. The men are holding though. And the French are getting worse. That's it. Level 3 in all sectors along this new Maginot line. We've now made the West Wall. Hitler now announces West Wall 2. Now on the other west side of the Maginot line. And the air bridge is holding. Yes. I did it. That's it. The French are for the taking. Should I let the attrition drop or should I just go for it now? I mean, the more and more forces are going to come and try and fight their way through here. And these units are not getting reinforced. Even though I've got an air bridge, their strength does not go up. What do you think I do, boys? Is it time to break through? I've got like a hundred divisions. No, at least 50 divisions that are ready to go through. Yeah, I don't think it's going to get any lower than this. Should I go for it? Rommel, it's big brain time. Let's just slam, you know, 21 divisions, uh, 20 width into these front lines. In fact, it's a party. You're all invited. Schnell. Before they realize what's going on, just smash through the front line, open it up, and let the divisions come through behind you. Execute Order 66. You think it would be like a news bulletin saying, Breaking news, marginal line breached. Critics say how. Oh, show the casualties. Good idea. Right then, German Reich, 100k men. Versus, not only taking out Poland. This is the total war. Let's have a look at France. Oof! 810k. Not necessarily just from that maneuver alone. I will give it that. It could be other casualties in there, like the one I'm causing now. But you could easily say 700k from that marginal line bypass. Come on, keep going. Just smash through that REMS. Go around them. You don't need to go through them. They're putting up a little more of a fight than I would have liked, but I'm pretty happy. I know the progress is slow, but I did achieve my... Hold on. Infant paratrooper pinned that unit down. For, yep. Let them getting circled. Motorized. Do the job of going around. Power drop achieved. Yes. Plan is a go. Use glider planes, though, please. Come on, get the ep. Move and conquer. Move onwards. That's it. We did it, boys. Hit that fat dab. Because France has now capitulated. Yum. And look at this pocket of units, and they can't go for Belgium either. I think I'd like to have a shout out to my Fordin Jaegers. They did a lot of the back work and they took a hell of a lot of casualties to get it done. Remember, each unit parachuted in with like a third strength from 6k men. That basically means two in three of the gliders are shot in, shot at on the way in. Like, comment, and subscribe, or I'll break your fing legs.